hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is all about body hyperpigmentation a few people have asked me what can i do about hyperpigmentation around specific parts of my body so i thought let me make this into one whole video just talking about all the body parts that you can use this specific product so the product that i'm talking about is the ordinary's glycolic toner this is an aha an alpha hydroxy acid this basically will exfoliate your skin it will increase your skin's cell turnover so basically it will reveal brighter looking skin because it will fight the dead skin cells and the dark spots that you might have this is what took my armpits from zero to a hundred you guys and when i say zero to a hundred i mean just like better than it was before like this is what my armpits look like to me this is good this is what i hoped to achieve because my armpits used to be very dark i'm gonna put a video up there for you guys to see so you know what i'm talking about so i'm also here to tell you that this works on different parts of your body so all your hyperpigmentation worries this is your best friend just some little disclaimers about this product you guys you don't want to be using this during the day if you want to do further damage to your skin by all means apply it apply it and go out in the sun don't do that i'm joking please don't do that this is basically gonna make your skin a little bit more sensitive to the sun so you want to make sure you're using it at night time it's like afternoon time for me and i've applied it on everywhere on my body so basically i will not leave my house and this is the only time i'm gonna apply it so that goes on to my next step which is apply it only once a day roughly if you're starting out i would say maybe like three times a week for me when i started out with this product i was quite desperate so i use it four times i think like five times a week i'm not even gonna lie to you but i didn't react because my body doesn't tend to react to things as much as my face does so i was like do you know what let's just take the risk but i don't recommend you doing that i recommend you patch test first just to make sure you don't react to it and like i said make sure you wear spf when you're using this you guys a lot of people tend not to notice a difference when they use this product because they're not wearing sunscreen if you're not wearing sunscreen you're gonna make your skin worse when you use active ingredients first thing is the face of course so i do use this on my face you guys it is a very good toner i tend to use my hands for this because i feel like i waste a lot less product when i use my hands so i just rub it into the palms of my hands like so just like a few drops oh that was more than a few but a few drops is all you need and then i rub it into my palms and then i just pat it into my skin just like so before i jump into my next step for my face i tend to let this sit for like 10 minutes onto my skin before i jump into like a serum or moisturizer i like the product to absorb into my skin this is quite important you guys you need to make sure you're leaving your products enough time for them to absorb because if they're not absorbing then they're basically all mixing together and it's not going to work as effectively as you might hope so for the next body part what is connected to your face it is your neck so you guys a lot of people do miss out their neck when it comes to their skincare routine you don't want to be missing out your neck if you've got two different colors going on that's not a problem we can fix that we will use glycolic toner there as well so what i tend to do is i grab a cotton pad because i prefer to use a cotton pad when it comes to my body and then i put it into the cotton pad I, like a few drops onto the cotton pad and then i will rub it along my neck so like so just like so and this will do its thing you will start to notice a difference like i said like it's very good stuff so it's very important to not miss out your neck the next step is my armpits so same rule applies to my armpits i just add a little bit of the product onto the cotton pad then i'll go under my armpits and i will just rub it in so yeah And then I just kind of like let this dry. I mean, it's gonna dry itself, but I just try and make it dry a little before I put my arms down. 
And just like that, your armpits are done. So the next body part is a body part that people have asked me a lot about when it comes to hyperpigmentation. So that is the elbows. So a lot of people did ask me, like, what do you do about your elbows? My usual routine would ex include exfoliating properly under my elbows. This just gets rid of like any dead skin cells that I might have. And then of course I would go in with this and then I would moisturize. Moisturize, 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 you guys, that is key. And then I go in with some cotton again. This is just a cotton ball. I ran out of like the cotton pad. But yeah, so this is just the same thing. And then I apply it on to the cotton pad. Then I apply it onto my elbows. I don't know why it's not focusing on my elbow. Here you go. I just do the same on the other elbow as well. That's what I do for there. So of course, when you think of elbows, you might think of knees. I mean, I don't know if that's just me, but yeah. So then the next body part is your knees. So I do the same thing on my knees, you guys. So I'm gonna have to get up for this part. So that's what I do for my knees. So I just gently apply the products in like circular motions. The same thing that I did for my elbows and my underarms. That is like the same kind of technique. So another place that I like to apply this product is my inner thighs. When I tell you this thing goes everywhere, you guys, like I'm literally not joking. I feel like some parts of our body we tend to neglect. And for me, I used to basically neglect like my inner thighs. I did struggle with like dark inner thighs for so long. And I realized it's because my thighs use to rub together a lot. Like I'll be walking and my thighs would literally be just rubbing together constantly. So that friction can cause um, darkness. It can cause discoloration so over time that discoloration can build up and if it's not properly treated of course it can get darker and darker so that is what basically happened to me i apply this the same way that i apply it onto my neck i just basically get a cotton pad and the glycolic toner and apply it on to the cotton ball and i just rub it into my inner thighs again and then that will eventually start to lighten that area and this is a type of product that works quite fast, in my opinion. Leave your experiences down below, of course. But for me, I started to notice a difference after like two weeks, if I'm honest. Maybe my skin just reacts to things pretty fast. That's another thing that I probably would say. But for me, after two weeks, I noticed a change on my face. So that's what made me actually put it on my armpit. Because I was like, girl, if you are evening my skin tone on my face this quickly, let's see what you can do for everywhere else. If you guys have any questions let me know in the comment section if you have any queries or you want to know you know some things about the product just let me know in the comment section this video is not sponsored by the way you guys so these are my genuine thoughts on this product so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you enjoy the rest of your day or your night depending where you are i will catch you on my next video thank you guys so much bye